Tom. Hi everyone and welcome to 5 Minute Fusion, a Who's That Anime podcast where Colin and myself, Steve, will take the journey through episodes of Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball GT, God Help Us, Dragon Ball Super and beyond. We're going to do them all in a quick 5 minute summary as best as we can. Colin, are you ready to continue this journey? Uh, co- of course. Of course. Right, we're going to get kicked off as we normally do with a quick synopsis of the episode, episode 9, Boss Rabbit's Magic Touch. Goku, Bulma, and Oolong drive into a city to get gas, unaware that they are still being followed by Yamcha and Puar, who then hide behind the wall to spy on them. Everyone in this town seems to be afraid of Bulma, but after she buys some new clothes and gets rid of her bunny costume, no one even notices her. Just as they're about to leave, two men in bunny ears begin to hassle them. Goku beats them both up, so they call in the boss. The boss, whose name is Monster Carrot, arrives. He is a giant rabbit whose special power is his touch. If anyone touches him, he or she turns into a carrot. Not knowing this, Bulma slaps him, turning her into a carrot, which Monster Carrot grabs. His two men then start to beat up Goku. Watching from behind a wall, Poir turns into a bird, snatches the carrot out of his hand, and Yamcha beats up the two men to save Goku. Goku then hits him with his power pole, forcing Monster Carrot to surrender. He changes Bulma back. Goku then ties up the Monster Carrot and his henchmen and takes them to the moon by extending his power pole proceeding to force them to make treats for children. Colin, what did you like about this episode? The ending. <laughs> Fucking stupid. <laughs> he just yes. contains them up in the moon. <laughs> I was a bit concerned about their oxygen. Uh, no, there's no no need to concern about the oxygen. There's oxygen up there, obviously. Yeah, it definitely doesn't seem to be a problem. Um, I've, I've written... Um, <laughs> Uh, I've <laughs> read a couple of things. Um, the main one is uh, the part where Oolong uh, is like, what are we going to do, Oolong? And he goes, run for it! And then just drives away in the car really fast. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that that really stuck with me. Uh, it was pretty great. Um, what, what didn't you like? Uh, reading out the name of the title, because the rest of it is all right. It's, uh, what was the title again? Boss Rabbit's Magic Touch. Boss Rabbit Magic Touch. No. It's definitely a reason I didn't play this episode in front of my children. Um, and I was like, maybe, like, sometimes these episodes are alright. And I was like, no, no, this one, this one doesn't sound good. And also, I think in the episode description, it's like, Bulma gets what she wants whenever she wants. And I'm like, oh, God. Right, never mind. <laughs> Pretty much. Now, what? I have written, uh, the bunny accents are a problem. <laughs> like, <laughs> and one of them was, hey, hello. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, we, oh, blah, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. And then the other one sounded like Snagglepuss and was all like, ho oh, ho, stage left, even, <laughs> for some reason. And um, it just really bugged me. <laughs> they were like really bad approximations of other other voice actors. But yeah, it was, uh, it was quite something. Yeah. It just irked me. Uh, so what do we now know? <laughs> uh, there's a rabbit that can turn you into carrots. And he's quite big. I think big. that's valid. He is. Um... I liked his car. He had a bunny car. Bunny cars exist. Oh yeah. Um, this is oh. Yamcha was getting mixed up with Bulma in this one. I might be wrong. I might be excessive. Uh, I don't know. I I feel like Yamcha seems to be almost capable, which is something he has never made out to be in Dragon Ball Z. I... Memory. <laughs> He is almost cute. <laughs> uh, he's uh, just he's famous for dying and whining. I mean <laughs> he's doing quite a lot of whining in this. He is, he is doing a lot of whining. I did also notice that Poir can drive. I can't remember if Poir drive drove before, but in this one it particularly stood out to me. Yeah, his, so she Poir was Poir was driving and Yamcha was uh obsessing over Buma. That's right. He got even yeah. in to the point where he was dribbling. Yeah, he, he frothed at the mouth, which was mildly disconcerting. Yeah. Um, Goku doesn't like carrots. I thought that was worth note. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he doesn't. He's like, carrots? I don't like carrots. And the power pole can extend to the moon. Uh, I wrote that saying power pole a lot makes me laugh. <laughs> uh, they said it like about 20 times in about five seconds. Yeah. <laughs> It gets really, they can go to the main really quickly in the power pole. Really, really fast. Uh, Surprise, faster than rockets, it would seem. Yeah. Oh, 
we are out of time for this episode. Uh, I'm just going to stop the timer there and we are going to be back next week to talk about another episode. So we'll see you next time. That's a bye from me. And a bye for him. Bye, folks. Bye. Look out for the wall.